Are you ready for the head-to-head -head between Dollar Shave Club and Wet Shaving Club's Safety Razor? Unboxing first, then we'll get to shave. All right, let's see what's inside the wetshavingclub.com little burlap package here. It's like Christmas morning. Look at this. Let's undo a little thing here. It's got a little... Oh, you can get 30 cologne wipes for eight bucks. There you go. Get your man wipes. All right, let's undo the burlap. Aha! Here we go. So we go, wow. Whoa, baby. Look at that. You know what this is? This is a hundred Dorco blades, right? A hundred? I believe there's a hundred Dorco blades in there. So I'll open that in a minute. And here is the Wet Shaving Club razor. The, let me get this out of it. Get out of here. Go, go make a scarecrow or something. All right, so let's see, take a look at the, this is their cheapest one. This is the $24 package. This is what we get for 24 bucks, and that will last you a whole year, maybe longer with 100 blades. Now, let's see, how do I open this thing up? Does it slide out, or do I take the top off? Hold on. Oh, there we go. It kind of slides. Ooh. There it is. All right. Empty box. Here's the razor. Ooh, it's got a nice, oh, and look. You get a little bit extra inside. Yo, see, you get a bonus. You get a few bonus ones here. And there's just the packaging. So here's the razor. It's got a good weight to it. Looks like to be a three-piece razor. Let me unscrew the handle. And here's the head. Head is lightweight. It's got these little guides in there so you can't mess up. And the handle is where all the weight is. That's a good... I guess you could turn that into a quill pen. That would be nice. <laughs> But we'll keep it a razor for now. And yeah, it's a three-piece razor, but it's got these little... Uh, the design is such where you can uh, uh, lock it in there and you know that the blades are going to be even on both sides. It's got a closed comb safety bar there, just a safety bar. And uh, what kind of blades? Are these Dorco too? What are these? Super stainless steel blade. I'm not sure if that's Dorco or not. But anyway, so that comes in there, and that's what you get. Let's see how that sucker shaves, shall we? Hi, everybody. It's time for a head-to-head -head shave versus safety razor and a cartridge razor you all know about. We've all heard about these shaving clubs. There's Harry's, Gillette has one, and Dollar Shave Club. I think they kind of started it all, as far as I can remember. Um, so you pay a subscription. They send you new cartridge blades every month. They send you you know, like eight blades every month or every two months. It comes in a package like this. This is like the refill box, so it's nothing fancy. But this is what you get inside. This is the Dollar Shave Club. And this is what they call, this is their starter pack. It just comes with a, uh, it's a, they're all cartridge razors. And it comes with four cartridges. So I think this to begin with, if you start this off, it's gonna cost you about $48 a year. So you're gonna get this and you're gonna get, I think like eight cartridges. They may have changed it recently, uh, but initially you're gonna get this handle. Let me put this down. And then you're gonna get a blade. Let me get a blade out of here. Let me see if I can figure out how to <laughs> attach it to this one because it's each cart. Oh, there we go, there we go. So this is a two bladed cartridge. So that's good, I like that, any more than two and you're just looking for, for clogs and problems and stuff. So they send you four. And if you subscribe, it's like $4 a month. You're supposed to change this out every week. Um, yeah, so over, over the year, it's gonna cost you $48 for this, okay? And what I'm gonna put it up against is the Wet Shaving Clubs Safety Razor, they are a shaving club that doesn't do subscriptions. You don't have to pay them every month to get a discounted price. They send you a safety razor. This is their cheapest one. This is the $24 safety razor. It's good quality, it's heavy. Uh, it's got, it's a three piece, so you'll unscrew it. I'll show you that in a second. And it comes with, I gotta hold this up so I don't, 100 safety razor blades. So it's gonna last you, they say this will last you a year. I'd say it lasts you more than a year. So you get this and this, no subscriptions, nothing like that, $24. That's it, $24. Here's what it looks like inside. I, I've taken the, uh, the liberty of opening, the, uh, opening it up. Here you go. There they are. So you get 100 of those, and then you, let's load this thing up. Let me show you how it works. 
if you've never used one of these before. Three piece means there's the handle and then the head is two pieces. So what you do is you take the head, take the top part of this, so this is when you're holding the razor, that's the side up. So you has got the little uh, screw right there and you gently and carefully take the razor blade and put it right on top and let it sink down. And then it's got these little guards so it actually fits in. And then you put this right way up and then you screw the handle back on. And what you should always do, now this one has these little guards on it as I showed in the unboxing, so it should line up the blade perfectly on each side. You gotta make sure, <clears throat> yep, looks like it's fine. And the nice thing about this razor is the blade doesn't hang over the side so you can actually hold onto the head and tighten the handle down. <clears throat> there you go. So that's the safety razor from Wet Shaving Club. $24. Get you both of these. <clears throat> and then $10 the next year for that. So there you go. So they sent this stuff to me. They have not paid me to review it. They just said, wouldn't it be cool if we put up our safety razor against these other shaving clubs? I'm going to do Harry's coming up. I'm going to do their Gillette one coming up all against this razor, their lowest model. They have three different models. I'll talk about that in a minute. Dorco blades. I think they're good. I haven't had much experience with them, but... Uh, Let's try it out. I took a shower, did my hair. I'm gonna use the John Paul Jones Shave Soap from Heritage Hill Shave Company. Oh, it smells good. <clears throat> Using my Sinatra Lynn Signature, that seems like too much like an infomercial now. I'm just gonna start shaving. <laughs> like, this is not a paid advertisement. They just said, would you mind, the, the nice folks over at Wet Shaving Club, thank you, by the way, for doing this. I thought it'd be kind of fun to check all these things out. They said, we want to put up our really affordable safety razor uh, subscription service, even though it's not a subscription, against all the big guys that you hear about. And I said, yeah, if you want to do that, send them my way. And so here we go. Let's see how it works. They even said they're willing to take the L. Like, people might prefer that cartridge razor over their safety razor. <clears throat> they were willing to give that a shot. They, I might even prefer the cartridge razor over the safety razor. But the point they were trying to make is, over five years, <laughs> of course, if you do the math, <laughs> over five years, that $48 subscription turns into $240. But for the Wet Shaving Club, it's $64. Because you're just buying new uh, razor blades. You're not buying a new handle. This handle will last you the rest of your life. So if you don't want to... Add to the uh, plastic, this is a very lightweight handle, and uh, but like I said, it's good that it's got only two blades, so that's nice. So I'm going to do one side of my face with this, one with this, and we'll see what the shave is like. And I'll talk about the Wet Shaving Club's other razors. I always like to start on this side. Now a lot of people ask about safety razors that have never tried them before, and they're a little scared of them. They're afraid they're going to cut their faces to ribbons, and you're not going to. It's, that's why it's called a safety razor, because of those little bars. Those little safety bars. The uh, razor blade is only touching pretty much your whiskers. It's touching your skin, yes, but it's mostly taking care of those whiskers and that safety bar helps you. This is a, a very mild razor, I'm, I'm noticing, but not too mild. You know, there's some razors that you shave with, it's like, did I even shave? But this one, it's got a good handle. I wish there was some more grip because this is a smooth handle. It's got these little ridges right here, but I kind of, it, I'm not, it's not slipping in my hand or anything, but I kind of wish there was like some knurling on it to get a little bit better, but it's a long handle, so I kind of support it with my pinky, see that? You want to see the difference between that and my Rockwell? I'll show you the, the length difference. See that this is quite a bit longer. There you go. It's not too long, it's not too short, feels pretty good. All right, I'm gonna go down with the grain for the first pass on this side of my face. All right. Pretty good, like I said, mild, so it's not gonna take every bit off. Now let's check out the Dollar Shave Club. So you can get a better idea. This is very, doesn't even say Dollar Shave Club or anything on it. It's very kind of like, you know, cheapy plastic. Um, the cartridges are proprietary. I wanna show you something here after I do this first pass. Now with a cartridge razor, you have to press a little harder and and wash it off a little bit more because it, those two blades will clog up a little bit more than 
the single bladed safety razor. So I'm gonna do my best to try to get as equal a shave as I can. You know, this feels like a cheap, a very cheap kind of like, you know, very disposable uh, razor, which you might not even care about, you know, but these are my opinions. I mean, how could they be somebody else's opinions? If I'm telling you. <laughs> and some people swear by the cartridge razors and they'll never want to change and that's fine. I always say that, so I've said this a thousand times. Shave the way you want to shave, all right? Okay, let me feel the first test. Let me do this one. <laughs> I'm just, I'm hugging myself. This feels like, the safety razor feels like it got a little bit more off. Down here. Feels about even on the neck. All right, let's go with the second test. I want to show you when I said this is a proprietary blade, meaning their blades, the Dollar Shave Club blade, blades, will only fit their razor. I want to show you. Um, here's, I don't even know who this is made by. This one, this cartridge will not fit this handle. This Gillette will not fit this handle. They all have different ways they connect to the handle. This Mach 3 will not connect to this handle. I looked at all these before, it's like, now, yeah, these are proprietary blades. So these, this is Harry's, and we'll go over that later, but that's a totally different connection system than this one. So I know my cartridge razors. I've got them. I've got a bunch of them. So, <laughs> and so you're not going to be able to change and say, all right, I don't want to use, I like the handle. I love the handle, but I can't, don't want to use the blades. But you can't, you got to use these blades. So you're kind of stuck there. And uh, with the safety razor, you can use whatever blade you want. They wanted to make sure that people at West Shaving Club said, let them know, you can use whatever, whatever. You know, you can buy the handle for 24 bucks, get a hundred blades and be out, you're done. You don't have to buy anymore. And they're putting a lot on the line, let me do this, but they're willing. And they just wanted kind of my uh, general opinion of it. Now, when those, Dollar Shave Club and everything started coming out. I was like, that, is a, this, that was before I was started uh, safety razor uh, shaving. All right, second pass, across the grain. I was like, that is a good idea because I'm sick of paying like $25 for four blades or whatever it was, you know, just some outrageous amount. But I never, uh, never bought them. Never, I don't know why, I just didn't, didn't get into them. So it's interesting for me to try these. I've tried the Harry's before. I've never tried the uh, um, the Dollar Shave Club that I'm doing right now. And I haven't tried the uh, Gillette subscription service either, which I will try in an upcoming video. All right, so there's the second pass with that one. It's just a more pleasant feel, the safety razor. If you've ever used a safety razor, it's just a much more pleasant shave. All right, here we go. Across the, across the grain, the Dollar Shave Club. I mean, this handle in this this blade just seems so cheap. I mean, it's how they can get away with being, you know, I mean, 48 bucks a year is not expensive. But if you got to spend another 48 bucks for the same sort of thing next year, I'd rather, I mean, this is 24 bucks. This is $24 for this safety razor. You want to buy another safety razor, get it if you don't want to. They're very simple. They invented the safety razor in the beginning of the 20th century and they didn't ever need to change it. They did, they added, you know, adjustables and butterflies and things like that, but they didn't have to. The design still works perfectly. All right, second pass. Can you hear it? It's, there's, there's a teeny bit more that I can feel on this side than there is on this side. So I always go for a third pass. You don't have to do three. Some people's skin, you know, can't take a third pass, so don't do it. You don't have to. I just do it because I'm crazy. Because I like to get, I like to feel baby smooth skin on my face every now and then. Not every day. I'm not, I'm not that crazy. <laughs> I'm a little bit lazy, you know. A little bit crazy, a little bit lazy. I'm a walking contradiction. Partly truth and partly fiction. All right. Third pass, this feels very good. Like I said in the unboxing, the uh, the weight is mostly in the handle. It's a very lightweight head, but it's got a good feel to it. It doesn't feel cheap, like some of the ones you might find at Walmart 
like the Vanderhagens or the Wishies that just feel like they're made out of, you know, stamped metal somewhere in the world. Now this one is not made in the U.S. This one is sourced from overseas. I don't know exactly where. So if you're interested in the Wet Shaving Club, it's, which is wetshavingclub.com, the, the links will be below. Um, they have two other razors that they sell. So this one is the $24 one. It comes with the razor and the 100 blades. They have the Triple S, which is 100% stainless steel. That's only 40 bucks, and it looks different. Look on their website, it'll be below. I don't have that one. And then... They got the Merica. It's actually spelled apostrophe M-E-R-I-C-A. Merica. And it's made in the USA. It's 100% marine grade stainless steel. I don't know what that means, but it sounds good. <laughs> I don't know what marine, how marine grade is different, but I know that you got to be able to withstand a lot more on the ocean. So if you're shaving on the ocean every day, you might want to go with the Merica. And that one is 90 bucks. So that's, you know, that's getting up there. You got the 24, the 40, and the 90. But with the $90 one, you get 200 blades. You get two year supplies. There you go. There you go. Oh, see that? I almost just automatically started shaving with that one. My brain is showing my, my, my preference. All right. Third pass with the Dollar Shave Club. Now, the things that I will say for this is, um, it's got two blades. Otherwise, I would not be happy if I spent, you know, whatever you spend for the first one. I think it's like $20 now, and they're trying to uh, put their shaving stuff in, like shaving balms and things, and uh, then they're kind of wanting you to buy that stuff too on the reg, but you don't really need to buy that that often. You know, it lasts a good long while. So if I'd spent whatever the layout is, 20 bucks, I think, for the first, and I didn't know that I could get this one for $4 more, yeah. But like I said, if you use Dollar Shave Club and you love it and you're done, fine, that's great. Oh, God. I keep doing that. All right. Let me, let me get some water up here. All right. Yeah, both shaves are fairly equal. There's a little bit more off my neck on the safety razor side, but it's it's good. You know, they they both shave fine. So this one does not blow this one out of the water by any means. But this one, compared to this, like the build quality, uh, the the expense, and you guys must have known I was going to go for this one. I mean, just for the expense alone, that's why I changed over to safety razors because I got tired of paying for those cartridges. And especially if you can't like use whatever cartridge you want, Dollar Shave Club is not for me. Um, gets to be too expensive for what you get. This is very cheapy. Uh, maybe they have some better quality ones that I don't know about, but uh, this is their uh, what they call their humble twin. So this one's the winner just for build quality, uh, the coolness factor of using a safety razor. If you've never used one, give it a try, 24 bucks. And then, you know, you spend that much on, you know, a couple cups of coffee these days. <laughs> you get one of those pumpkin spice lattes, you're spending $37. So anyway, yeah, yeah, go with this one. 24 bucks, 100 Dorco blades, which are good quality blades. You can't go wrong. Wetshavingclub.com. Thanks, guys, for sending this to me. We'll do this again with Harry's, and we'll do it with Gillette. Their subscription services, too. I'll have to write all the stuff down. I've got this whole sheet over here. So anyway, <laughs> oh, free shipping, all that stuff. No monthly fees, no subscriptions, no proprietary blades. Use whatever you want. That's all. That's the end of the infomercial. All right, I'm going to put some cold water up on my face, and then aftershave. And I use the... It's still no shade November. I feel like everybody's tuned out now. I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> so ch kudos to you for uh, sticking around. Because now you get to see the Osage rub. Time to get rubbed, folks. If you never use this, go buy yourself some. Don't be frightened if it burns the first time. That's what it's supposed to do. Oh. It smells like being transported back in time to some old barbershop somewhere in the Midwest or something. I don't know. All right, 
Use a little bit of this uh, Boss Man beard jelly for this goatee of mine that is itching. But this stuff takes care of that. Yes, it takes care of it. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you thought it was interesting. And if you didn't, that's fine. We'll come out with something else later. But uh, yeah, so we'll go head to head again. Wet shaving club, safety razor, and when they're, I think they're gonna send me the Merca one. So if they do, then uh, that'll be cool. I'll check that out. But anyway, stay tuned everybody. We got two more head to head battles. Will the champ be defeated in the next round? Don't know, we'll see. Probably not. <laughs> I got, oh God. I gotta pick up the, the razor on the ground before I cut my foot off. See y'all later.